Okay. Um, I wanted to run over... I gotta shut this window. I am minutes away from running down to Skid Row to do some more filming um, for this VR 360 documentary that I'm doing. And I just wanted to go over some of the equipment that I use and some of the things that I bring with me and techniques that I use to go down to Skid Row, talk to people, and film in a way that doesn't draw a lot of attention and put an unwanted target on my back. First, here's the bag. That, you'll notice, is just a regular bag. It's not a camera bag. It's not a uh, pelican case. It's not anything that's going to draw attention. It's not supposed to look professional. I'm just supposed to look like a dude wandering around. I have this little satchel. Your belt goes here. And it sits on the side, it's four lenses, but what I actually put in it is a zoom mic recorder, shotgun mic. Sits in the side, that way I can hold the shotgun mic out there and also just whip it out at a moment's notice. Insta360 Pro with the little lens protector on it. Goes in the bag, nestled into a towel. So it's a little bit padded in that very uh, unpadded bag. Photography tripod that folds up real nicely and has a long neck for my VR camera so it's easier to stitch out the legs that pop out of the bottom. And today I am bringing Mavic Air drone, DJI drone. I'm gonna throw that in there uh, just in case I get the opportunity to kind of fly down a street or something. You know, you're a guy with a camera. I like look like a magician because I walk around with the tripod like a staff. You know, it's everything's fully extended. It's ready to go. I feel like the White Wizard in Lord of the Rings with like, oh, or like my staff, you know? And so I'm walking around like this. It's not the most friendly and inviting uh, look that you could you could have. And when you're trying to make people comfortable with you, you want to look friendly and inviting. So that's not the best way to do it, but one good way, bring snacks. Tonight I'm going down with some socks, dried fruit, crackers, little toothbrush, toothpaste, Slim Jim, a bunch of Ziploc bags, I don't know, hand sanitizer, first aid kit. That, I got a bunch of stuff that I think can be useful and I let people choose a couple things, kind of like the dentist or Halloween or something. Um, a lot of people ask for money. There's always the, hey, you got five bucks? Hey, you got a dollar? Hey, you got change? I don't really want it to be about money. This stuff is a thank you. Money is a transaction, and I don't want it to be a transaction. Yeah, so that's how I get down there. That's how I try and work my way around there. If you have any other tips, let me know. Oh,